Blair. That's got to be Birger. She wants us to rescue him. Oh. Stories, my man. How could Birger have survived a fall like that? Magic, perhaps. Let's make sure to ask once we've extricated him from this situation. Probably the, um, you know, Griffins that he landed on. Should be easy to find Birger from up here. Why did everyone sound so scared at this place? And on that note, Dragon! <laughs> I'm fine. You? <laughs> well, he seemed angry. What do you suppose that means? We are going the right way. Hello. Where are we anyway? Looks to be the ruins of a once thriving Vanier settlement. What happened? Don't rightly know. More reason to find a way out. Um, is that supposed to be there? Or is this a visual bug? I am concerned. There is also a dragon. I am concerned. Gateway. Dragon has its way. It will not. Do you see what I'm seeing? A lightning bolt. Except it's frozen. Like the one made in my fight with Thor. So why would there be one just like it here in Vanaheim? Hence my concern. <clears throat> Alright, well here's a giant fucking open area. The area I now get to explore. Time's a charm. Wait over here. Mm. Speak. The day this valley was destroyed, my spirit was torn, split in two. Part of me, it lies out there with my remains. Perhaps if this brooch was tall at me, it would uncloud my mind. I could find peace. What do you remember of the day you died? Everything is hazy. I remember I was nervous. This brooch. 
I plan to propose to my beloved. Please, I beg you. Restore me. Restore my memory. Then I can tell you. Tell you all I know of that day. Your remains. Where are they? I was looking out upon the valley. Then the ground. It shook. I tried to dodge a pillar as it collapsed. I must not have made it. Idiot. This specter may be able to tell us what happened in this valley, brother. The Leviathan froze that lightning. Do you think Mother was, you know, here? It means nothing. We do not know that Faye was here. True. But that frozen bolt tells an unfinished story. If we want to know what really happened here, we need to know what that spirit remembers. Hmm. Then we go. <sighs> And I need to know how to get the fuck up there. I don't understand. Vanyar used to live here? It's just a crater. It wasn't a crater when they lived here, lad. <laughs> Something happened to it. What? Like an explosion? It'd have to be huge. <laughs> Something is wrong with this kill. Dragons do not leave marks like these. We've seen those marks before in the Valander mines. Remember? Must be a soul eater around here. I can hear the animals. They're afraid. Aye. Let's keep a lookout for other kills. Soul eaters hide in plain sight. But how do I go about? Uh, I see. To get through there, though. Still haven't heard any of Odin's ravens. Another kill. It's a sign we're on the right trail. We're getting close. I remember last time it looked just like a pile of rocks at first. Hello? Interest. Still, crystals are valuable. Perhaps we'll find a use for it. There is seriously just so much this area. Holy fuck. Dude. And still no ravens. Stay alert. 
Aye, some rocks are not like the others. Steal yourselves. What the fuck? <laughs> firing at. Well, no. that question. It is over. Maybe now life in this valley can flourish again. I'm sure Anvari would be happy we killed another one at least. Anvari, the dwarf who put his soul into a ring. That's right. He created the soul eaters. Whatever happened to the annoying bugger anyway? I lent him to Sindra, and he said he lost him. Uh-huh. Lost him. Hey, well, without it being nighttime, I can't do shit, so... Um... No doubt about it. Just like the frozen lightning bolt in Midgard. Yet I have never been here. Curious. Yes. Mark. I see an altar up there. If we can reach it, we can change the time of day. Right. Now, if we can reach it, looks like that has got to go the long way around. As I'm sitting here now killing everything in my sight.
strike and retreat. Fucking... Fucking dead. Stupid. Another one of those mysterious crystals. Okay. 
Journal he dropped could tell us more. Lies. Written by Yirka. Well, perhaps that's who this fella has it out for. We have brought you what you asked. Thank you, my love. She waits for me in Folkwanger. Now I can ask her to spend eternity with me. How can I repay you? Tell us what you know of that day. I remember walking into a mead hall, and Thor was there. In Vanaheim? Do you know why he was there? There were whispers that he was looking for a Vanir military outpost. I didn't want any trouble, so I thought I'd quit. That's the last I saw of him. But maybe there are others who saw more. I wonder if Thor was meeting someone at the meat hall. Whoa. Do you think Thor was meeting Mom there? Faye never drank with me, and she would not have with him. Sometimes we never really know the ones we love, but... Yeah, my mirror knows that best. Fuck. <laughs> Just look at him and Sigrid. Oh, hello. Hmm. 
Yeah, this area is massive. claim to worship Skadi, but they kill just to kill. You would have never wanted that. No. There is purpose here, even if we do not see it. <laughs> Rust. Nothing. At all. What was that? Tremors. From the Earth. Or something else. I never heard of tremors in Vanaheim. Something is causing this. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> How much more can I find? Fuck. 
Some Vanir turned to dark magic to defend themselves from the Aesir. There were consequences. The Trimmers. They come from beyond that gate. Let's find a way around. All right. Find a way this, find a way that, do this, do that. Fuck, man, they're so... Oh, it's one of the stags. Hold on. Big man, boss needs your help coaxing this stag back to the world tree. The boss needs your help, mind you. Not me, I'm doing great. Got a belly full of stag feed, living life, but yeah. Talk to him back at the round between rounds when you got a moment. Uh. Great. <gasps> Shut up up there. <laughs> Fuck me, dude. Back. It's that dragon again. No, a different one. Well, come out of here. I'm gone. Good lord, there's just so many. Anywhere with that dragon around. Watch out. You sure about that? Cause fuck you, that's out. I wanted to tell you. I read something in Odin's library about what Galahorn is supposed to do. If blown by a god, it sounds through all the realms and harmonizes the space between them. Blow it somewhere like Tyr's temple, and it would be like opening up all the realm travel towers at once. It's quite a vulnerability. I wonder why he didn't just destroy it. Some artifacts defy destruction. Well, we should make Freya aware of this. Hmm. I will bet you, you could hit this child with that axe if you tried. Oh. No. You're here! Thank goodness! Here's what I found. What a rambunctious bunch. Speak. The tree has become rather overgrown. And? And if it grows too wildly, the branches risk getting too heavy and falling, which is not ideal considering they hold all the rounds. I am no gardener. What an absolute shock. No, I do not require any horticultural skills from you, but I would ask that you keep an eye open for the stags of the four seasons. They normally graze upon the tree and keep it tidy. Unfortunately, Bitter decided it would be funny to trick Arrogant into releasing them. If you happen to find the stags during your travels, I would greatly appreciate assistance in bringing them home. I would have one of my spectral squirrels do it, but they, well, keep eating the feed I give them. Consequence of it being the most delicious food in all the Nine Realms, I suppose. We have seen these stags. Great, then all you need is some feed. Once you've found a stag, the feed should calm them down. Then one of my spectrals will guide them back here. And, uh, don't eat the feed, please. I will not. Vigilance asked me if I was too chicken to release them, but I am in fact not chicken-like whatsoever. So as you can see, I had no choice. Yes, of course. What else could you have done? <sighs> While normally this would be a harmless prank. We now, are leaving. Any luck finding those leaves? Was the area that had the uh stags? I think it was this one right here. I think 
Back to the crater. We still have unfinished business there. Fjörgur's still stranded in hostile territory. Fjörgur's still missing? You better hurry. Enough. I remember. Got more food at home. Come on. I have to say, quite a nice change of pace helping these stags get home. For a moment, I was worried we'd have to kill them. Yes. You had a plan to kill it if it had attacked, didn't you? Yes. <laughs> I'm not surprised. It's Kratos after all. All right. Well, let's take a look here. Actually, let's go to Muspelheim. Niflheim. Niflheim. Mimir. Odin's mask. How do you hear about it in the first place? He said a voice spoke to him one night, entreated him to collect the mask and control his own fate. I still think it's all a bunch of bollocks. Odin got drunk, convinced himself a wooden mask would solve all his problems, and pranced about the realms until he found a sufficiently mysterious bauble to fit the bill. Mask probably doesn't do anything at all. Yeah, probably. Uh, or it could do everything that he wants. You know? Expanded my wear. You got the raw materials to make them. Thank you. Uh, love. What now? The riddle. What gets bigger the more you take away? Love! What kind of chub buffling relationships you been in, Amir? That don't make any sense. Agreed. Oh, fuck. I won't be lectured on the nature of a romance by the two of you duffers. Uh, yes, bigger the more you take away, I oh. Yeah? I know my answer to it. No, I hate the way it looks. Dragon scaled breast plate. Now, here's the thing. It's a trophy. A good fit. Ah, I'm missing the money. Oh, look at me. I'm nearly dragged out. Look. Still not enough. Um. All right. Started selling some of this stuff. Start selling what we don't need. It's been a long time coming, guys. Come on. I wish there was a way to do this, like, all in one go. Again, I hate the fact that it's a, a full-on armor. But, uh, whatever. And there it is. All right. Mm. 
Nope. Oh, where is it at? Craftable. Dragon Scaled Girdle. There it is. Damn! Am I good or what? Very good. There's the trophy. Nice. Nice. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Mommy and Daddy, tie the noose tight to send us to Odin to bask in his light. Did they just see what I think they said? Yes. We tried to escape. We clawed. We screeched. But nothing escapes. The Keeper's reach. Omir, how do we find this Raven Keeper? I'd love to, brother, but I've no idea where we'd look. What if the Keeper's even still alive? We will find her. Ah. Uh... Ooh. Ew. Well, there goes all my XP. Uh, let's, let's, ooh, child. do it and Atreus you are now maxed out good job need right. anything boys what you no got, no 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 Alfheim's a hundred percented. Alfheim's at. Wait a minute. Is there a stag in Alfheim? That seems like a very so Alfheim like thing Vanaheim to do. Alfheim wasn't supposed to be so humid. Was that the effect of Fimble Winter there? To a great extent, it seems. So Midgard had endless night and cold. Svartalfheim had earthquakes. Alfheim had the light randomly pulsing. But Asgard didn't seem to be having any effects at all. Odin had a long time to prepare. No change I noticed in Helheim or Muspelheim either. Now that I think of it, the more primordial realms might be less susceptible. How do you suppose Jotunheim is faring? Uh, how would I know? Just training your powers of speculation. I don't know. If nobody's there to see, does it even matter? But lion boy. Still undiscovered. Still undiscovered. Fuck! All right. Worth a shot. I was curious. It's like, oh, that could have been the stag. Yeah, no, 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 no. Hmm. Mm. There's so many quests there. All right, let's return to Sindri's. So, father's new spear—it's made out of a ring. Drop me an eye, forged by the Hulder brothers as a gift for Odin. How's it work? Every so often, the drop me drips out identical copies of itself. The Huldras presumably figured that if one golden ring was a good gift. An infinite number of them would earn them a permanent place in Odin's heart. But it didn't. Not even a little. All right, let's, uh, let's get going. You are the best. You've always been the best. 
Hey, tell her she's the best. Oh, you bad. The heroes of the hour. I want to hear everything. I mean, when you're ready, I'm not giving orders here, am I? Try to rest, Ingvi. Let the herbs work. Oh, they work? Oh, they, they work very well. Because you make things better. You always have. Jesus. Since we were kids, I find a new way to get into trouble. Enough. Look at that. <laughs> you really did it. How, in all the nine realms, did you manage to kill Heimdall? I knew our spear would do the trick. Well, happy Ragnarok, everybody! <laughs> Let's drink. Is it true? Heimdall's dead. I can't believe it. There's no stopping it now. Odin swore peace only so long as you spilled no more Aesir blood. I refused that deal. Yet he honored it. But now... But what? You and I know better than anyone that Odin's promises never last. We have the advantage now. It's time to bring him down. No. None of you understand what's coming. Odin's vengeance will be his only concern. Not his only concern. The mask. Whatever knowledge it unlocks, that's what Odin wants more than anything. If I go back to Asgard, go I can't... Go back. Go back. Look. If I can finish what I started there, awaken the mask, get answers, maybe that's our way out of this. But I gotta go soon. Before they figure out what's happened. Choice, you are home. Do not ask me to put you at risk again. He's at risk where he stands, Kratos. We all are. Anything we do or don't do is dangerous right now. But Odin needs me. He trusts me. I'll be safe there. From a tactical perspective, am I wrong? I don't much like it, but it is our best play. Dividing Odin's focus would buy us time. And give us a pair of eyes in the enemy's inner sanctum. But if there is truly a source of infinite knowledge, you can't let Odin have it. Aye. And once he has what he needs from you... Then I lose my leverage. I get it. I'll be smart. Father. I can do this. Remember our promise. You too. You know what you're doing. I do too, Sam. Well, I still want to hear how you did it. You mean how we did it? Ah, uh, you have me. And therein lies a tale. I kind of want to hear the tale. Oh. I kind of want to hear the tale. Trance, listen. I can't let you go back without this. A hammer? Your key, please. <laughs> you ever need a way out of a bad situation? Throw this down hard and say Wergi. One use only. Wergi. Thanks, Indri. Hope I don't need it. Me too. Alright, Odin said Hugin would be waiting in the cabin. 
Mimir, anything else I should know about Odin? Maybe a weakness or something? Like if I flip up his eye patch, he'll disintegrate. I lad, wouldn't that be? Yeah, no. Sorry, Mimir, I can't do your accent. I'm on my own for this one. Terrible. Here we go. And we're back. Oi! Where's Fenrir? Where's our sweet lad? Fenrir! Specky! Svana! Svana? Good girls. Is Fenrir around too? I haven't seen him. I wanted to let you both know that I might not be around for a while. I know you're gonna be fine, but don't worry if I'm not back. <laughs> it's okay. No, really, it's okay. It'll be okay. I love you too. Specky, maybe one day you won't sit with that leg out, but it's okay if that doesn't happen. You say how you want. It's okay. Okay. No, I I first off. No, I can't put this off any longer. I want to know where Fenrir is. <laughs> I want to know. Where is big boy Fenny? Fenrir. No, you're not back there. Who the fuck has uh, piled up my wood? Found him. Ben? Huh? You made it back! Uh, hey. This is your wool? Ah! Stop doing that. <laughs> oh, were you having a moment? It sort of looked like you were having a moment. I can go. No. Sorry. This is Fenrir. It's okay, Ben. She's, uh... <laughs> so, I was right about your knife. Huh? I'm glad you found a place for his soul. <laughs> me too. Hey, uh, how'd you find me here? Loki? This is my marble. And where are you heading off to? Back to Asgard. Hey, I'm actually using him. Uh-huh. Angerboda, look. Once I see this through, I'm gonna know everything. How to save my father, how to stop Ragnarok, and maybe, hopefully, how to bring our people back. Loki, those are all very noble intentions. But he's Odin. You have faith in me, right? Of course I do. I just hope the story you're writing for yourself is the one that you truly want. Would you, would you take care of Finn while I'm away? I'll take good care of him. Oh, don't forget Specky oh and Svana. Be careful, Loki.
May maybe I'll learn okay. how to how to bring our people back. <laughs> You're literally looking at the only female giant. Matt, you right. could bring your people back. Gotta help Odin complete the mask, but also make sure he doesn't get any answers from it. Easy, right? He's probably a piece of cake. Hmm, nicely equipped. What needs work? Hmm. Nah. Don't give two shits. Alright. I'm probably gonna start the next cutscene and then I'm gonna go. After it. If you had nothing to do with it, then why is he here? Just because someone isn't here. Uh sorry for interrupting. Oh, you're not interrupting anything. Forsetti's investigating, so the truth will come out soon enough. I hope it does. You'd better go. Fine. Fine. Okay. Panic does nothing. Harness it. Heimdall's dead. Happen to know something about that? Anything? Well, I mean, everyone hated them. Sure, sure. But have you seen anything? Something noteworthy? I mean, you know, he did sock through pretty hard while we were out. Maybe someone found out? Got even? I, I don't know. Are you suggesting my son had something to do with this? I don't know. Honest. Well, I have to ask. Never believed you had anything to do with this. I'm glad you're back. So, I figured out what went wrong. I mistranslated a word here. Did you know? I thought it said beyond the cry of cold breath, but it actually reads the cry of first breath. Well, that's somewhere else entirely. I know where that is. Young man, you've done it again. Go. Take the mask, take the sword, take the bird, find Thor. We're going to Niflheim. Too. Oh, we got Ingrid back. Okay, well. Hey, Ingrid, you wouldn't happen to know where Thor is. Yeah, I figured. Okay. I'm gonna just have the stairs here. My head is pounding right now. Thirsty, I'm hungry, and I probably just need a nap. Oh. But I'm gonna get going. Uh, tomorrow, tomorrow's Tuesday. Uh, given that this week is Thanksgiving week with Black Friday, I don't know about the weekend. Um, if I'll be streaming, I'm gonna be pulling a fucking probably 13, 14 hour shift on Friday alone. So I don't think I'll be doing this weekend whatsoever, just to recuperate from work. Um. Tomorrow for sure, Wednesday for sure, and Thursday because I have Thanksgiving off for sure. So, uh, that being said, thanks for everyone that joins. Uh, I'm not getting double pay. I get paid commission, so it's whatever people decide to buy. So, uh, with that being said, I'm going to get going. Adios, everybody. Bye-bye.